पिता गुरु बंधु सखा गुरु मात पिता गुरु यू से आई डोंट इवन नो व्हाट आई हैव टू लेट गो ऑफ प्लीज लिसन माय एम्फसिस इज नॉट ओनली अबाउट लेटिंग गो the emphasis is not about just letting go you can let go of everything you can let go of everything and still keep your person who would just start picking up new things you follow yeah yeah that's what i've realized this <laughs> yeah, you can days, keep so, yeah. just letting go let go let go let go mm. hmm that's why when i say i surrender i surrender I surrender and surrender eh huh? the master say then you must surrender the surrenderer also how oh <laughs> i didn't count myself as part of the deal <laughs> is it and in the same way you say yes i let go i mean letting go letting go letting go letting go but if ultimately you yourself is not let go and who's going to let go of you you see because mm-hmm. um, the final thing you let go of everything but you're still standing that's it but actually you're the one that we want to get rid of actually <laughs> you're getting rid of everything <laughs> look i did it yeah. yeah but what about you we don't want you oh but i don't know how can i throw for myself <laughs> i'll do it so we go one step more different different step <clears throat> that even the one who is apparently letting go of everything <clears throat> which is the favorite hanging out place for the consciousness in its expression as life it hangs out in the one who is the doer of actions and the thinker of thoughts the me the person someone told me today i don't want to be a free person oji is it is no free person don't become a spiritual person just be free hmm? <clears throat> so then this hmm, one who has been giving up and doing all this giving up and practicing giving up you can even sit there doing om namah shivaya om namah shivaya this same one <laughs> huh? if he's in here om namah shivaya okay <laughs> hmm? and he's the ego inside he's still thinking i am om namah shivaya better than anybody else I'm more quiet than everybody. You're still competing, it's not true. How to get rid of it? Can he be clean so well, clean, 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 clean until he is just awareness? No. <clears throat> so what is this final step if there's a step? We're going to show you now. <clears throat> this one. Hmm? who has never properly been suspected as the culprit the one who says i want to be free oh yes he wants to be free this one which you think is you this is the favorite idea you have of yourself i have given up everything i've been practicing meditation for 35 years muji yeah and yeah well 
I'm still not free. <laughs> Professional yogi. What is freedom? Perhaps the one who is saying, I want to be free, I want to be free. And now I take you to the door. Come, let's go in. Uh, just a moment. <laughs> Last minute things to tidy up. I'll be back. Mm-hmm. Boom. He's not going to come back. So watch it now. There's an awareness here. <clears throat> it is the truthful tenant of this house. Let's call it this crudely. <clears throat> In the space of this awareness, this idea of a you as a seeker is born. It is also <laughs> the offspring of awareness. I want to do this, I'm practicing this, I'm getting closer, all these things. The only way you can go beyond this <clears throat> is to recognize, keep recognizing that. This one also is perceivable. The idea you have of who you are is suffering from ideas it has about itself. Again, the idea you have of who you are is suffering from its own projections. And this is the crux. Because when it comes down to it, this one has to disappear. How going to disappear? And who will witness its disappearance? Is it going to disappear of its own doing? Is it going to Disappear. <laughs> My master told me that also. When I was caught, he says, If you wish to realize the truth, you must vanish. Vanish? How do you vanish? <laughs> How do you vanish? <clears throat> but I was not even thinking how I vanish. The impact of his words and the power of his grace <clears throat> had caught this delusion and something began to. <clears throat> but outside, I tried to be calm. <laughs> Inside, it was completely a mess. The master's words, his pointing, had caught <clears throat> the thing that could not be seen clearly. Inside stutter, hot. Identity was there. <clears throat> Identity was there. And then it felt like all these voices coming up. Why is he talking like this? He's not my master. He's not Ramana. See, the ego is fighting anyway. <coughs> but the serum was in. Yeah. Yeah. This anger on the surface, uh, why is he talking? Uh, and inside my mind, I say, you know what? This is just what I needed. I've been in luck now too long. This is not luck now, this is bad luck now. Mm. I've got to get out of this place. This was the signal, I'm getting out, getting out. And then after satsang, ah, this fire inside, like cooking sausages or something. And there was a fierce sense, I have to get away from this place. I know I will go to Tiruvannamalai. Yeah. I went home, started packing. Get away from all these Westerners. Also. Mm. <laughs> A 
But after, it was a very hot day. <coughs> I couldn't pack anymore, it was too hot. I went out to get some air. Inside, still shh. <coughs> then after sitting under a tree for some time, I said, OK, I've got to go. It was like walking. I, had my, I was walking like a walking cloud, or with my own cloud raining on top of my head. <laughs> and then it was time to leave. And as I was walking some few steps, some I don't know. It didn't go poof. Just poof. <laughs> And you know what happened? I could not find myself. Listen. Eh? I could not find myself. Who couldn't find himself? I could not find myself. I could not find any context or reference or memory of who I am supposed to be. <clears throat> Suddenly looking at my hand, but there was nobody in them. So then I was looking out, saw the rickshaws going by, but everything felt like a kind of silence. <clears throat> there was just a sense of vastness. Everything is floating in this vastness. <clears throat> and then suddenly comes this great love for Papaji. And I realized I did not love him before. <clears throat> I would not allow myself to love him. Because my ego saw him, how you fall in love with a butcher? This was the feeling, but in that moment, everything had gone. <clears throat> we don't know what we are preserving. It's like a reflex, something just automatically tries to protect. <laughs> but I am here because there's a higher prayer in you. That says, however much I try to escape, finish me off. I'm a good runner, Muji. Don't let me get away. Because of this prayer, I am here, and you are here. The mind knows exactly where the exit of this house is. First, we're seeking. <clears throat> the seeking is born, and consciousness arises as a seeker in search of truth. It is also an authentic expression, actually. It is an authentic phase that the consciousness must go through. It is waking up. But at a certain point, you have come here, and I can only tell you, now this one who has been giving up things, and realize, wait a minute, I'm giving, I keep giving up, and I'm still, I'm still here, I'm still having trouble. And I said, okay, <clears throat> now it's time for a stronger medicine. What is this medicine? You are here to be aware, <clears throat> a deeper consciousness. A deeper force is here that is aware 
of this sense of yourself feeling frustrated, doing everything. <clears throat> Be in this place. Acknowledge that there is space. <clears throat> More space in you than I am the seeker, frustrated. There is a space, there is a gap where you can begin to observe. Maybe it might seem like there is no space to observe. But I will tell you, everything that happened with you is observed. So even this seeking in you, <coughs> I am not sure if I understand, Mujina, there is an awareness of this. <clears throat> and you, you give it away all the time when you speak. You give it away, but you are not aware that you are doing it. <clears throat> you are revealing that there is a seeking power, that there is a seeing much deeper than you are conscious of. <clears throat> you see, now I am making you conscious of it. So then you can begin to see that even this <coughs> role that you have been playing, as a seeker, succeeding, evolving, is also phenomenal. When you see this, <coughs> the deeper place of seeing, <coughs> is free of pollution. <coughs> it is not personal. It is clear. There is no boundary. There is no preference. <coughs> there is no religion. There is no sect. There is no conditioning. <coughs> there is no gender. There is no obstruction. There is no obstacles. Who is aware of this? So, who is aware of my words when I am speaking? You have done what you can in that field. Don't keep going around now. Now I encourage this looking where you have to admit it is nothing so metaphysical. It is quite simple actually. It just needed to be pointed out. And you need to acknowledge, actually, yeah, actually it is true. There is a deeper space. <clears throat> Whereby I myself, the idea I have of myself, my favorite self image, is now being accepted. It is an image. It is not myself. The greatest self portrait, the greatest artist, if it was a great artist, let's say a Rembrandt or something, made the greatest self portrait. It is still not what he is. Your role is only your latest version. You have been many versions, isn't it? You are like a work in progress. Cut off a little bit here, put a little bit here, making up yourself as you go. Which one is the true you? But each time you are identify with a certain image, you feel this is who I am. This is who I am. Then the time comes, you have outgrown this one. And that was who you are not. So the same stage, something tries to protect it. And say, but, but this is what I am, this is what I am doing all these things. But soon you are able to see that actually that is just a thought I have about myself. That is a feeling I have about myself, which I have given a lot of importance to. And because I imbue it with importance, I must stand by it.
It is very simple. Be in this deeper place. I'm calling it deeper for lots of words, I don't know. It's actually depthless. Be in this purer place. <coughs> every thought, every feeling began from nothing. It began from the vastness. It sprouted. Because what I'm sharing with you now <clears throat> this this point has created the greatest reluctance in the human kingdom, the fear of exposing that this is only an idea I have of who I am. This present identity is only an idea in the great vastness that I am. It's just my latest picture. And I am attached to it. Something is attached to it. Who is this I who is attached to this image? A power arising from consciousness, the power of belief, the power to identify comes, caresses this image and says, This is me. It is believed and believed into existence and becomes your experience. Have I gone too far to talk like this? Okay. As soon as this begins to open up, of course. For many people hearing this for the first time, you know, sometimes physically hmm, the mind force will block your ears. Ah, you can't hear. You're looking at me going. <laughs> you can't hear. I experienced that in front of my own master also. Inside was coming when he when he caught my lie. A siren went off inside me. <laughs> Literally. And I couldn't hear. I was looking at him reading my letter. And I tried to look at him. I was hearing nothing at all. Except it came through when he say, If you wish to find liberation, <laughs> you must vanish. Everything else I don't hear. And everybody else, <laughs> nothing. Your mind can do this. It doesn't want you to hear something. As you're talking, it goes blah, blah, blah. Hello, ha, ha. Bird fruit, hi, how are you? <laughs> you don't hear anything. Why would it behave like that? <clears throat> because you're onto something. You you stand a chance to 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 find out something. <clears throat> And your resistance has come, because something is strongly invested in keeping you in a mundane state of consciousness, so that your concern daily is only about your meals and paying your bills, which okay, you have to do. But is that what your life is? And when it comes to a deeper realization, a deeper understanding, it's like you're too lazy or all these things. <coughs> but you're here. <laughs> what 
What you have heard so far from me is enough to wake you up. <clears throat> but I have to keep singing this song over and over again. What does God look like when He wants to look like something? He looks like you, without ego. Tere charno me swam 